Jenny Thomas, the wife of Supreme Court Justice Clarence Thomas, privately praised religious rights group First Liberty Institute for fighting efforts to reform the Supreme Court. I got an email uh, today from Jenny Thomas, uh, Justice Thomas's wife. And so she said, great to meet uh, through uh, the meetings today. I cannot adequately express enough appreciation for you guys pulling into reacting to the Biden effort on the Supreme Court. And then this is in all caps. You guys have filled the sails of many judges. Can I just tell you? Thank, and this is all caps, thank you so, so, so much. On the same call, Shackleford attacked Justice Elena Kagan as treasonous and disloyal after she endorsed an enforcement mechanism for the court's newly adopted ethics code in a recent speech. And then you've got Kagan from the inside really being somewhat uh, disloyal and somewhat treasonous in what she's doing. Shackleford's private call came two days after President Joe Biden announced support for Supreme Court reforms, including term limits and a binding ethics code. Kagan's comments came before Biden's, and she did not mention the structural proposals Biden endorsed. On September 1st, Justice Ketanji Brown Jackson said she too was open to an enforceable ethics code for the Supreme Court.